Hi everyone, my name is Sierra and I'm a second year student at the University of Toronto. Today we're going to be inflating a balloon using an acid-base chemical reaction and investigating how this happens. The materials that you will be needing are vinegar, baking soda, a funnel, a balloon, a spoon, and an empty bottle. First, start by taking your empty bottle and filling it with around half a cup of vinegar. Next, take the funnel and insert it into the top of the balloon. Use your spoon to add two tablespoons of baking soda to the funnel. Carefully maneuver the funnel so that all the baking soda ends up inside the balloon. Place the open end of the balloon containing baking soda over the lip of the bottle containing the vinegar. Be careful not to spill any of the contents from the balloon into the bottle. You can now add the baking soda to the vinegar by holding the balloon in an upright position. Watch as the balloon inflates. This is due to an acid-base chemical reaction. This happens from a chemical reaction. All chemical reactions start with reactants, which are our starting materials. They combine and produce our products. The chemical reaction that occurs between baking soda and vinegar is called an acid-base reaction. Acid-base reactions produce two products, one being water and the other being salt. In this acid-base reaction, vinegar, our acid, reacts with baking soda, our base, to form sodium acetate, the salt, and water. One other product is formed, carbon dioxide, and we can see this as it fills up the balloon. In solution, an acid produces hydronium and a base produces hydroxide. When this reaction occurs, there are equal parts, hydronium and hydroxide, which neutralize the solution. An example of an acid-base reaction can take place in the human stomach. The stomach is filled with something called hydrochloric acid, which is very strong and good at breaking down the food we eat. Sometimes our stomachs produce too much acid, which can give us an upset stomach or even heartburn. When this happens, people often take an antacid, which is simply a base. Because antacids are basic, they react with the hydrochloric acid in our stomachs and help neutralize some of the acid. This effectively settles our stomachs. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to try this experiment at home and send us your pictures. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.